Hello and welcome to Chappie's Info Short. I'm your host and photographer, David T. Chapman. This week's Bird of the Week is the opportunistic, highly adaptable ring bill gull, the oldest of which has been recorded at the age of 28 near Cleveland, Ohio, USA. Typically, their lifespan averages around 11 years. The ring bill gull's wingspan is 47.5 centimeters, 19 inches, and they have a wingspan of 127 centimeters, 50 inches, or 4 foot 2. Their habitat is a mix of cottage life as well as the fast life, often found by lakes, coasts, fields, sports fields, islands, beaches that are more open, breakwaters, parks, but can also be found near dumps, landfills, and yes, even fast food restaurants. They range across all of Mexico but do not breed there. They also overwinter in the southern U.S. up both the Pacific and Atlantic coastlines and the lower Great Lakes and pass through most of the central U.S. to their breeding grounds in the northern USA states and Canada. In Canada they breed from central to eastern BC, the very south of the Northwest Territories, all of Alberta, most of Saskatchewan and two-thirds of Manitoba, as well as most of Ontario except for the far northwest of it. On the east coast, they breed along the St. Lawrence River into the northern Maritimes and all of Newfoundland and southeast Labrador. Ring-billed gulls are birds that nest in colonies. It can be a smaller colony of 15 to 25 nesting pairs, or they can range right into the thousands. The female incubates around three eggs that are brownish gray with dark marks. The nest is in a scrape on the ground, generally quite shallow, where the eggs are incubated for roughly 25 to 26 days, give or take a few. The nest itself is lined with sticks, grass, pebbles, and other objects made up of plant materials. They have a very high range of options when it comes to their diet. They will pick garbage, eat fast food, as well as take from gulls and shorebirds. In the wild, they eat worms, other seabirds, eggs, grubs, waste grains in fields, insects, spiders, fish, which is primarily made up of smelt, and even the odd mouse they will eat too. Thank you for watching today's program on the Savvy Ringo Gull. For more great programming like this, Feel free to hit the like button and subscribe to my channel. Until next time, happy birding. Cheers.